you know, when it's not... You've got the wrong guy. I, I never challenged you to a duel. What the hell? Do not tell me you are backing out now. I thought you gnawed monkeys. I can't, I can't move. See? I'm not even a gnawed. I don't like it here. There's too many bugs. Yeah, I can sympathize. This town reeks of the dead. The odor is sound. Shut up, I'm trying to hear what these two are saying. It might be important, because I can't move. Sweet Jesus, why is, what is going on? Everybody leave me alone, let me deal with one quest at a bloody time, thanks. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim, where I am being mobbed by just about every quest giver in the entire region at the same time. There are three freaking things going on at once there, apparently. Anamla was blabbering about something. She just killed a man with a fireball, and there's a talking dog. So, pretty much just your average day in Skyrim, then, it seems. Um... You, we've met before, haven't we? Yeah, you're the you're the grumpy ex Thalmor lady who lives in the inn. Uh, yeah. Uh, do you have any idea who that man was? Hmm. Now that I think about it, perhaps I have seen that muskrat of a beard before. He might have even recruited me to assassinate some hunters. Come to think of it, I might have even agreed to the contract. It sounds like something I would do. I'm almost sorry I terminated him. So... <sighs> You're all heart, Gerilith. I will be whatever I want to be. That is my right as one of the first children. It is the other races that must adapt to our whims. Oh, please. I will punch you in the face. I will. Absolutely. Did he give you anything or mention a bard named Bodan? As a matter of fact, he did mention a bard by that name. Here, take this. I certainly have no need for it. Note for Gerilith added. Cool. All right, then. Is that talking dog gone? Please tell me the talking dog is gone. Okay. There was a talking dog, right? That just wasn't a figment of my... Incredibly stressed to breaking point imagination. Okay, well. Note for Gerilith. Gerilith! Oh, I don't know what it's saying because there's a quest thing in the way. The business with the hunters will not be necessary as our contact, Severus, has been killed. However, the Baron would like your assistance in another matter. A red guard bard by the name of Bodan has been inquiring about the murder of his fellow company men. While the Baron is well acquainted, uh, well acquainted with this company, he is not responsible for their recent demise. Nevertheless, he cannot have this bard poking around in his business and asks that such behaviour be put to an end. I've already dispatched a band of soul swords to do away with him and his fellow company members, but should they fail, I hope we can come to an agreement. Price is no object. In the meantime, to maintain my cover, I will pest you at the inn tomorrow night. It is merely an act, so I beg you, please do not take offence to what I say. Sincerely, Florentus Ivanucci. Let me just read that again. This is just for not being necessary. Contact's been killed. Baron would like your assistance in another matter. Bodan's been inquiring about the murder of his fellow company men. Baron's well acquainted with the company. He's not responsible for their recent demise. So this Baron fellow is not responsible. Nevertheless, he cannot have this bard poking around in his business. Now see. Okay. Okay, so there's a bunch of cell swords on their way to go and kill Bodan. We're probably going to have to put a stop to that. If I had to guess. If what that note says is true, then Bodan gets some exercise yet. Although by the looks of it, 
He's not the only one. Oh. Cell source traveler. Five by my count. There's someone there. Huh? Found you. Greetings. Really? You're who they sent? For the love of... Thank you. Horse! Piss off! Oh. Okay, now this is where the visibility... All that uh, black thereof is becoming a problem. Yes, I do think I can take you with your bare fists. Idiot. Can we go inside first for it's a bit brighter, please? Okay. This is an ode to Skyrim's. Please oh, no. Did you need something? Can I make a request? What can I do for you? That you shut up. Sure. My voice could use a rest. Thank you. Okay. What are you got to say about this then? Well, we better check on Bodon. If these cell swords are any indication, he's gonna have a lot of corpses to burn. Tonight. I will kill you. I will kill you. I will rip out your esophagus and strangle you with it. I know that doesn't make any sense, but I'll do it anyway. Uh, you aren't worried. Uh, you aren't worried about this assassin. I am, and I'm not. It's different when we're all working together. I get that old feeling. Gods and the hist are on our side. In any case, let's go back to Morthal. If this Baron isn't responsible, maybe Boda knows who is. Point taken. Let me just. Can I just dry out a bit here? Yes. Get out of my face. Sit down. And shut up, thank you. <sighs> okay. I'm in my happy place. I'm in my happy place. I'm in my... I'm, I'm surprised I haven't turned to drink sooner than this. To be honest. Okay, okay, okay. I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's go. Oh, before we do, actually. Uh, Runil. War is not new to Falkreath. You have only to stand in our cemetery to see that. Yeah, you've got... Ah, that was a perfect opportunity to do the whole get four coffins ready, ready thing. My mistake, five coffins thing. You, you never... No. Okay, never mind. Hoost is responsible for the cemetery here in Falkland. I take care of the shrine. Morwen of Skull Village sent me to ask a favor of you. Ages ago, but still. More one, you say? Now, that is a name I haven't heard in a long time. Left to join her mother's people on Salt Time, as I recall. I knew her parents quite well, you know. Vera and Ulfra were good people, very much in love. Now, what can I do for young Morwen? Uh, she wants this placed at her mother's grave. Ah, yes. Vera's silver necklace. It was a wedding gift, and she rarely took it off. I'll be glad to oblige. What a touching gesture. To display the symbol of her devotion in such a way. Tell Morwen I'll be happy to grant her request. I'm sure it will bring joy to her mother and father as they walk in... Do you mind? Okay, we've done a nice thing. We've done a nice thing. We delivered the... Okay. I can still hear it raining outside, you know. Alright, 7.42pm. You do not seem too concerned about what's-his-face, so we'll, we'll, you know, we'll, we'll chill about that, as far as we're concerned. Well, Jesus Christ. Okay, yeah, now we're satisfied. To Dead Man's Monthly events. Due to increasing levels of violence between the Stormcloaks and the Imperials, all planned public festivities have been placed on hold until further notice. So basically, we've cancelled Christmas. And we wonder why people hate the Empire. Oh. I escaped fighting in Cyrodiil, 
Well, I wouldn't complain if we could. I'd like a room. Day. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Cheers. I'll show you to your room. <laughs> so I'm never gonna fix Welcome that bug, am I? Where it says hundred gold and you only have to pay I'll ten. Right here if you need anything else. Um. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know, you go find a room somewhere or whatever, because I'm gonna go to sleep. What? Are you... In Dara and I like to keep to ourselves and run our farm. Oh gosh, yes, you're the one with the daughter who was horribly killed by the werewolf. Uh, you know what? You can you can stay here. It's fine. I'll just I'll just go to, go to sleep in, in the corner here. Yeah. Um. Okay. So, it's been an interesting welcome back to Skyrim, hasn't it? I jump off the boat from Solsheim. And we've got to run off and... Let me know if there's anything else purge Codlack's soul. And as soon as we get done with that... What are you doing? Go away! Um, as soon as I come back... I've got to... I've got to deal with this. I thought we were just going to go... Check on some lead that you had... Or your friend had and... But no, it was something else entirely. Holy crap, you know. Um, that tomato looks wrong. I have the static mesh improvement mod. That tomato should look different, but it doesn't. I think it has the wrong texture. Oh, never mind. Uh, lead them, though, so we don't have to look at them anymore. And we'll have that. I'm feeling well hydrated. Okay, right, we're set. We've had breakfast and all that stuff. I think it's still raining out there because it's Falkreath. Yes. Obviously, so it probably, yeah, would make sense. This place is just miserable. And I'm beginning to see why everyone else thinks it's miserable. Yeah, I, I've, I tell you what, I've closed my curtains now, so I can actually see properly, but it's still pretty damn grim out here, isn't it? We didn't bother to loot you guys, did we? Oops, I don't want, I don't want, I, I, no, I, I don't want your thick hood. You, you may keep that. Thank you. Uh, let me just put this on. Get my, my keys mixed up, because I've been playing lots of Fallout New Vegas, so... I keep pressing E to exit, and it's an exit, it actually picks stuff up. Bethesda, for the love of Christ, I've said this how many times, but I'm going to say it again anyway. Make up your mind on which keys do what, because I fucking hate it when you guys do that. They just, they just switch the keys around so they do the opposite thing. Every single game they do, it drives me nuts. As if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. Damn shame. Damn shame. Damn shame. That's what you have to say about the... <sighs> Never mind. Where's my horse? Horse. Horse. <whistles> Seriously? Oh, there you are. Right, come on. Damn shit. That is not what I wanted to hear. Oh, what happened? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Come on, where is it? I heard it. I heard you! You can't hide from me. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. You bastard. You big scaly bastard. No offense, Adam La, but they are big scaly bastards. Come on, where are you? You better not attack this town after I've gone, because I'm going to be very cross if you do.
These days I'm very cross as a general rule, but I will be extremely cross. You do not want to see me when I'm extremely cross, dragon. Wherever you are. I think he's up there somewhere. It sounds like he's coming from up there. Alright then, well. So, we were going to join like the Dawn Guard and stuff, but apparently we've got better things to do. Turn to Bodan at the camp outside Fulgenthur. Well, that's up near Solitude, isn't it? So that's a long way away. Let's go back to Whiterun for first and talk to Roderick and tell him that the giant's dead. And we'll talk to his soldier as well. And then we can think about going to Solitude. Um, that seems like a good idea. Yes, yeah, seriously, Dragon, where are you? He's like, on, he must be on the other side of a mountain nearby or something. Because I can hear him, plain as day, but I cannot see him anywhere. Oh, yeah. I think we're getting closer. I think he's down here somewhere. Come on, dragon. Come on. Show you. There you are. I saw you through the trees. I cannot believe I'm actually actively riding towards a dragon. There would come a time where, well, there was a time where I would immediately proceed in the opposite direction upon even hearing this in the background. Where are you, you bugger? Stupid fart. There! There you are! Right, this is... Okay, I have a plan for this, dragon! Where are you? Yeah, you there. Awaken dragon. Enjoy. Uh... Now then. Where is it? Where is it? That's more like it. That's how you speak to your betters. Right, Animla, I will be back shortly. Now then, Mr. Dragon. I will not be having any of this terrorizing of the countryside. It's just not on. You, sir, I'm going to turn into a productive member of society. The first thing we're going to do is... We're going to a Stormcloak camp. Yes, we are. You're going to do your bit for the greater good. You are, Mr. Dragon. And then you're going to go on your way, having learned a very valuable lesson in morals and ethics. Oh, the weather's nice up here as well. Excellent. Now then, the question is, can I remember any of the controls for dragons? I don't think I can, can I? Oh boy, that's the night vision key which I need to unbind. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't land. Oh god. Oh god. God. Oh god. Help. Um, dragons. Dragon riding. Don't want to dismount. Press space to toggle target lock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Attack your current target by pressing control. Got it. No, you stupid dragon. I want... No, 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 no. Oh. Why can you do nothing right? Get back here. Get back here right now. Down you come. Come on. I'm not done with you. You think you can get off that easily, do you? You haven't done your job yet, matey. You can't fly around here looking like a, 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 a freaking, you know, love child of a Balrog and a Salamander and, and expect to get off that lightly. It's not how this works. Hi, Animla. Yeah, thanks for following along. I just... We're in the wrong neighborhood right now. I need you back here. No, not over here with the ice troll, you complete and utter imbecile. Not my horse, either. 
Are all the storm cloaks down there dead or something? No, they're not. There we go. See? Uh, get on with it. Do what you dragons do best. Show me who's boss. Yes, hello, storm cloaks. I brought a friend. They didn't seem terribly fussed, do they? Not that I can really see anything from up here. I should, uh... There we go. You're attacking the horse, aren't you, you numbskull? No, not the hunter. Leave him alone. He's just a hunter. There. Kill the Stormcloak soldiers. Come on. That's more like it. I don't even know what he just did there, but just keep doing that. See how... That, see? I just set fire to a bunch of things. That's how this works. Kill it. Dragon, you are exceptionally rubbish. Like, seriously. Why is it whenever I fight a dragon, they're really dangerous and very, very lethal, and yet you, you're just not even trying, are you? Come on, kill the ice troll at least. What even? What? Just, you, you call yourself an awakened dragon. What can you do? You do a little bright red light show, and then that's it. Look, like you're hovering. Okay, now you're finally doing some work. As you Lazy bastard. Like, what even is that? What even is that? It's just a giant red fart, is what it is. Come on. No, not the horse. Not my horse, either. Where are you going? This way, back down here, come on. No. No. You know what, I can cycle through with this, can't I? Except there's nothing. Have you killed them all, really? I... I can only assume you have. Fine, fine. You know what, just... Take me to Whiterun. Oh great, it's raining here too. As you command, yeah, you were Muda Wuga Wuga Booga yourself too. Now, I hope you've learned your lesson. If I catch you flying around there attacking random people again, I won't be so nice. Alright. Go, go. Fart your red magic farts at some storm cloaks or something. Be my guest, but you leave the regular people alone, okay? Don't let me don't don't even think about it, dragon. You leave White Run alone. You leave him alone. You get the hell out of here. Go on, you skedaddle, chew. Seriously, I'm warning you. Alright then, fine, you know what, you just keep circling, but I've got my eye on you. You did not like it when I shot you with the big dragon ren bow of death. You definitely didn't. No funny business. Because I will shoot you again, and again, and again, and again. And don't, don't you talk back to me. Okay, listen, I will shoot you with this thing again, and again, and again, and... It's going to hurt you, and it's going to stunlock you, and you're going to look very, very silly when I absorb your soul, alright? Is you leaving? Yes, he's gone, I think, finally. Okay. Don't panic, everybody. It's under control. He was with me. I've taught him a lesson in uh, basic uh, civic duty. 
come see me at my store at White Watch Tower. Really not, not, not now, dude. You know, I, I don't know about you, Animla, but I think it's fairly reasonable. It's under control, all right. Miko's just, you know, he is what he is. You you try dealing with him. Come by Bella. I, I don't know. I mean, if these dragons want to come back from the dead and they want to be they want to be part of part of Skyrim, then that's fine. That's fine. But they've got to be, you know, they've got to learn to integrate into society. We can't have them, you know, performing their weird cultural practices. You know, especially when those cultural practices involve, you know, torching people alive and burning down towns and, you know, that sort of thing. It's just not on, you know. It's not on at all. I don't care how they justify it. Like, that's what we did a thousand years ago. I don't, you know, I don't give a damn. That's, that was a thousand years ago. And, uh, you know, I'd stuff Alduin. I'm going to kill him eventually. I'll get around to it. He's not so tough. Anyway. Roderick. Thrivald's dead. Skyrim is better off with one less giant. Much less one that's higher than Hrothgar. We've got a long way to go. At least there's a payday. Just let me know when you want to work again. Well, I'm here, so... What's the next job? It's a troll. Not high in work, mind you, but it's still better than wrangling some bear that's ravaging Bellator's larder. If it makes you feel better, it's not just any troll. It even has a special name. Bana. Weak, if you ask me. I would have liked something with punch. For instance, Long Eater, Death Jaws, or the Eviscerator would have been effective. Instead, we get some obscure metaphorical crap. Regardless, Bana is a proven nuisance, having ransacked a mead all, slaughtered several adventurers, all the requisite shenanigans. A hunter tracked him to Darkshade. A filthy cavern teeming with the murderous beasts. Remember to use fire, and good luck. Fire I can do. Uh, dead big time, actually, as a matter of fact. It's sort of my specialty. Uh, what did you do after you left the companions? Oh, there, there was the selling of the sword, primarily. I worked for mercenary company, sailed around, killed people. I have to admit, I miss the killing of the High Elves. No, no greater pleasure exists than killing Thalmor. They're so arrogant, so pompous, they walk around in their robes, shooting their little magic from their fingertips. Ooh-wee. I like to take the knife, stick it in their face, and make little kebab out of their eyeballs and other organs, and they scream. We even had a special dance. We would, we would get the eyeballs on the knives, and we would get in circle and sing song. It was... It was great fun. So that was mainly it. I loved many women, killed many men, and I, I enjoy life. That is it. I, I, I live for the gods. I understand that Talos himself was a lover of many women, killed many people, so I try to honor him by emulating his actions. I would love to have the, the armor like Talos. Have you seen that statue outside? I want that helmet with the wings, that robe and the, the scale armor. Perhaps someone can make that. Some enterprising, intrepid, talented soul will make that armor. But until then, I, I am content to dress like an inbred uh, wolf. Yeah, I mean, look at this. Look at this. The bones, the wolf hair. Who, who designed this? Who wears the helmet? Even Farkas won't wear the helmet. And I saw him wearing a tomato on his head the other day. He, <laughs> yes, even he knows that that's, it's beneath him. See you later. I like it, actually, as a matter of fact, Roderick. I think it was all right. And I, yeah, I wore the helmet, so... Shut the fuck up, you ginger bastard. All right. I'll go kill your troll. 
You're on thin ice, my pedigree chum. Come on, you. You're the only person around here who doesn't annoy me, and that is really saying something. Because it takes very little to annoy me these days. I have noticed this. Um, I'm, I'm hungry. I'm hungry, apparently. No, I'm not. That's sorted. When the Empire surrendered to the Old Mary Dominion, they shamed us all. Go away. Go away. Go away. Just leave. <sighs> okay. It's older. She's usually down in the marketplace, isn't she? I mean, who am I kidding? These these people never move around. They all just stay in, stay put in the in in the same spot. That is nice armor, isn't it? Don't you don't you think? He had a point. He has a point. Maybe maybe someone will make that one day. <laughs> um. And that there's there's what's his face with with no boots on, because. Reasons. Do you get to the cloud? You sold her. Once I've made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Hulda. I found this note on Ulag's body. Did you? So Ulag didn't make it past those giants then. More's the pity. If you found any of the sap, I'd be willing to pay you the same cut I offered him. Better price than you're likely to find otherwise. Um, oh, okay. I have some sleeping tree sap to sell. Ah, of course. How much have you got? Um, all I've got. Very good. Be sure to bring any more sleeping tree sap you find to me. Whoa! Lots of money. Okay. What can you tell me about the sleeping tree? How the tree came to grow there is a bit of a mystery. Some say that when Vardenfell erupted, a piece was blown to the middle of Skyrim and from the crater grew the tree. I've also heard that it was a spore that fell from an island floating in the sky, but that just sounds like nonsense. All I know is that the sap makes you feel as healthy as a cave troll, but slow as a drunk horker, and that it fetches good coin. Mm hmm. Farewell. Farewell. Uh, okay, so. I guess we're gonna go find Bodan now. Uh. Well, there's. Yeah, there's this troll. But where would this troll be? It's not showing me on my map because it doesn't open the map. But that's not normal, to be honest with you. That that seems to be a regular. Oh, it's oh, it's down here. Uh, that's sort of the opposite direction to the one we want to go in. So, but it is pretty close by. Um, I need to. Uh, it says J for journal on there, even though I've changed it. It's kind of annoying. Unnatural selection. Let's just tick both. So, yeah. Bodan's camps are all the way up there. Banner's down there. We did save a bit of time by riding back here via dragon, didn't we? So, you know what? Let's go kill this troll. Let's come back up to Whiterun. We'll get in a carriage. We'll go to we'll go to Solitude via carriage, and then we'll just have to I don't know water walk or, or swim across here or something. Do I still have those boots to let me water walk? I hope I do. Azidol's boots or something? Yeah, I've got them still, so we're cool. You'll have to swim, but you're an Argonian, so that's fine. Right. Was that slightly racist of me? Please let me know if it is, because I'm. I don't meet a lot of Argonians. I don't really understand. Never mind. Let's just go, shall we? Have we got anything worth selling? I've got plenty worth selling. That's the point. Can I be bothered to sell any of it, though? That's the question. God, all these things. Let's not. Let's leave those alone. Let's not touch those. Uh, could I with make making some potions? I've got a fair amount. I guess we're good for those two. Yeah. And naturally the game crashed just as I was leaving Whiterun. Awesome! Never mind. Just needs just just further reminding of myself. I completely destroyed that sentence. I just I don't even know where it was going to begin with. It just it just means I need to save more often is what I really meant to say, but my brain just sort of completely fluffed it. 
I, I, it wanted to say like three different things at once and just sort of settled on an odd compromise. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. This is why I don't record normally in the morning. Because I'm, I'm too tired. I, I, I'm not awake enough for this shit. I normally record late at night. That's when I'm most awake for some weird reason. Right now, you know, I, I'm not, I'm not managing it. I'm, I'm kind of fluffing everything up. Mind you, when you get into that kind of world of weird Skyrim bullshit, where everything is going out of its way to make the least amount of sense possible, like talking dogs, uh, uh, you know, assaulting you while while you're trying to view some sort of cutscene type event, while your companions jabbering at you about something completely unrelated to all of those things. What have we got here? Oh, it's a Dark Brotherhood assassin. Yeah, hello. Do your work. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. Well done, Animal. Well done. Um, yeah, it kind of it kind of puts you in this weird mental state where you're you're just starting to sort of, you know, there. Are, I don't even know where I was going with that either. Uh, so there's a skeever. Hello, skeever. Why would why would why do you, why do you even try that? Why would you attack something that's like seven times the size of you? What kind of animal does that? The skeevers like the honey badgers of of this world, but to be honest with you, I, I doubt even a honey badger would attack us two. You know. Honey badges aren't stupid, after all. That skeever definitely was. Now, heart consumed werewolf progress perk incre What? That's probably something left over. A script left over from the last time I was in this region. I assume. Um, since I'm not even a werewolf anymore. Now the question is, has Valheim Towers repopulated since I was last here? And am I going to get hoof sound effects again? Thank you. Don't know what it is with this game and its weird sounds. You a bad time to get lost. Okay! Hello! Should have brought the dragon here, shouldn't I? Looks like we've got a bit of civic duty to do. You know, it's that that phrase again. Crimson Archicurus. That's ooh. Oh, if I was the light armor character, I'm gonna take that anyway. Maybe maybe there's someone I can give it to. And um, la, the the rain's being weird again. Eh. Note to self, actually save your changes when you edit your ENB settings next time. Why are you... Nice bow, but this is not the time. Or maybe it is the time. Yeah, it probably is the time, actually. I take it back. Come on, then. Don't... Don't dodge my arrows. Who do you think you are? Oh, fuck you. There you go. What, 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 what? <sighs> That's the best we can do. I forgot how weird this game actually gets sometimes. Come on, is that all you've got? That's your best. You won't live much Nice try, Bandit Chief. Nice try. Ritual Helm of Boethia. Good grief. Look at that. Stros Mackay Scimitar. Ritual Boots of Boethia. Ritual Armor of Boethia. Where the hell did you get this shit from? This is nuts! I'll take it, it's worth selling. What about the helmet? 
probably also worth selling. Okay. Yeah, he says. It's just going to go in a chest somewhere. I'm never going to get around to selling it. I already have like 20,000 gold. Oh my god. with your crossbows. Still, damn it. Where is he? Oh, he's up there. Well, come on, then. My fatigue bar isn't going to last all day. Let's go and kill him, shall we? Little scrote. Come on. Did you kill him already? No, you, you you seem fairly convinced that he's still... Oh, there you are! I hope you're pleased with yourself. I don't know what led you to taking up a life of banditry, but I can assure you, chum, it was not worth it, whatever it was. I hope you're all feeling quite silly now, up in Sovereign Guard or, or wherever the hell it is. You, 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 you guys go. You know, you're given so much time on this planet, and you waste it doing this. No helping some people. No helping them at all. Right then. Get your horse, please. And let's skedaddle. And I'm thirsty. Whatever. I'll deal with that later. Okay, so... Troll... Is... Where exactly? Down here somewhere. Okay, how do, how, how do we get to down there? Without just leaping off the cliff? Probably have to go... Yeah, probably have to go down and around. And... That's the one problem with this country, isn't it, really? You have to... Just just to get to a cave at the bottom of a waterfall, you've got to go halfway round the damn province to actually get to where you want to be. Even though it's just there. Hey, wolves. Wolves. There you are. Oh, it's not dead. Now it is. Excellent. Okay. Troll should be this way, and... Okay, I may have underestimated how deep this water is. Let me leap across a bit, and... Yeah, I... Mm, yeah, my horse is having issues with the current, it would seem. Can we get across this way? Yes, we can. Okay. Shade. Well, I hope the troll's there, yeah, because otherwise we would have come all this way for nothing. Are you sure about that? Because the caves in Cyrodiil are pretty damn deep, you know, they just go on for... Oh, God. Get my keys wrong again. Uh, they, they seem to just sort of go on forever, those things, for, for no real re apparent reason. And to, to be honest with you, it defies all kind of geological sense, too. Um, but, you know, that's just me. <laughs> Catapulted into the ceiling by bones. What else is new? What have we got here then? Hello, Mr. Troll. Yes, there's Will. Why do you want to do this? Do you want to smack it in the face or do you want to use the bow? I mean, it doesn't really matter either way. I mean, it's just a... Just a troll. What's it, what's it even doing? I mean, it's taking its sweet time, isn't it? Okay. 
That wasn't it, was it? That wasn't the troll we were after. No. We're after a different one. Yep, I can hear him. Okay. A pitchfork. No thanks. Thanks, but no thanks. Oh, this way. Okay. Hello? Trolls? There we are. Hello. Look, I haven't got all day, mate, so I'm just going to... Thank you very much. And where's where's your friend Banner? Is that the name, the troll's name? Like, I really give a damn what the troll's name is, but... Okay, random wood elf. No, that's just another random troll. Could you, uh, could you hurry this up, mate? I know, you, I know you like to do your little troll dance at me before you attack and everything, but... Um. Hello? Another troll. Yep, you're doing your troll dance, and rather predict... It seems to end, you know, the same way for you guys every single time. I mean, you'd think by this point natural selection would have kind of sorted you out. You know, all the trolls that did the silly dance before entering combat tended to get killed and therefore have been removed from the gene pool. You'd think so, but no, actually. They're thriving. I'm a little lost now. Which... Which way did we come in? I think we came in that way, didn't we? Or not? Banner, hello. Whoa, you've got glowing eyes. That's interesting, isn't it? Alright, it's tougher than the regular troll. Fair enough. Still just a troll, though, at the end of the day. Another job ticked off the list. Well done, Animla. Well done. I should really be taking Farkas or somebody out with me on these jobs. We are doing it for the companions after all, but... You know, if you're not an honorary honorary companion at this point, you know, I'll see to it that you are, frankly. You, you live in your basket anyway, so you might as well be. You know, I mean, it seems trivial work, you know, kill this giant, kill that troll, but, in, you know, it's it's small steps. I think the guy's got a point. I think we ought to put the companions back on, on the map. We, we're a bit of a joke at the minute. Really? And not because half of our circle's dead, but because, yeah, all we seem to go do is go around beating up bartenders. I mean, aren't we just the greatest heroes of all of Skyrim? Smacking bartenders around. Aren't we magnificent? This is not the way out. Uh, can I just bash this? Yes. And it was barely even worth bashing. Never mind. Um... No, not this way. This way? Yes, this way, I think. Wow, there was some serious shit went down here, didn't it, really, when you look at it? I didn't sort of notice this so much on the way in, but... These trolls really made a mess. With some poor miners by the looks of things, that's just... Grand. Bloody trolls. And 
the shadowy group of assassins is very selective in its recruiting. Apparently not. Judging by the, the, the hordes of them that I've killed by this point. Okay. And it's still chucking it down. Is it just the is it just the time of year or something? Oh, is it just is it the wet season or something? Because we've had nothing but this so far. Nothing but this. Apart from that one time I was flying on the dragon. Apart from that one time, it's been nothing but drizzle and graphical glitches and and all that kind of stuff. Eh, whatever. Right, come on then, let's get back to White Run. Turn off our lantern before I forget, because it is using up all the oil. And we'll we'll go and see what next bit of strange and peculiar wildlife that, uh, that Roderick's got for us to kill. Just as soon as I, I take my horse to the vet, dear God in heaven, what is going on?